Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm back with another Dragalia Lost video. Today's video is going to be about... Helly. Halloween Ellie. I totally was about to call her Gala Ellie. That's why I paused. <laughs> it's gonna be about her. I given her her Mana Spiral. Uh, I'll start by saying this, is that before I did it, I totally did look to see like how everyone was kind of taking hers. Uh, a lot of people are not happy with how she's been a mana spiral. Some are saying, some saying she's worse now. Others, and I think based on the DPS chart, has basically said she's barely improved. So I'm gonna use her a little bit. I'm gonna use her in the only mode I ever use any light units in, which is the um, uh, the uh, Mercury Gauntlet. So I'll be able to use her here. And we'll see how she is. You know, I don't expect much, but I I, I don't know. It really did look like on paper they had barely improved her. And apparently her skill 1 SP cost has been basically doubled. So it's actually much harder to do her basic combo that you could spam all the time in her preform. Let's go down here. So... Her skill 2 has gotten better to make up for the fact that skill 1 is basically um, not as good. Like, it's hard to really explain other than by now she would have already had her skill 1 ready. And it just takes a real long time to get it up and running. So we'll go here, do the ha to try and go here. 30 seconds remaining, we should be able to do this. Yeah, that's crazy, because when I tested her before this, before her mana spiral, I wish there was a way for me to show before this, she had already done her full three rotation of something. In here, she's barely going to make it. Let me see. Uh, very quickly. She's barely going to make it in time. I have to do this. Yeah, uh... That's not good. That's kind of not very good at all. I did the previous level here with the her unmana spiraled version, and I was able to do it 10 seconds faster. Uh, I don't know. Maybe there's a completely new way of using her that I... All right, let me try and focus on specifically force striking to get her skills faster. Because I understand skill 2 has been improved in some ways. I think it makes it so... I think probably that's why they doubled her SP cost for some reason is that it's like okay we made the second skill better which you now spam over and over again this is but the last one. let's, finish let's this. see yes, I let's know if this. she's actually doing it if I hear the haw but she's not hawing right now there it is they can't change that about her her haws are still very good okay let's go here. yeah it, I'll have to look up that post that talks about specifically the changes they made to her just to fully get on about how much they didn't really change her. She seems barely better. Alright. Alright. Let's see. Obviously it would help as well if I could take a look at if they're paralyzed because she needs paralyzed punishers. Um, come on. Come on. There we go. You can make it. Come on, you got 10 seconds. There we go. Level 3. That did not seem really worth it, but... I don't think she's going to beat him in time. She's not going to be able to beat him in time. Alright, let me try and beat it this time by playing it, I guess, regularly. Regularly? regularly? The regular way I usually play. Uh, let's go here. To give context, by the way, I'm, I've been, it's, we should be able to beat it. We're 1,000 over. I've totally gone into, um, gauntlets before with units that just barely got mana spiraled. Zero testing and just put them in the brand new, um, Mercury gauntlet and they've been able to do fine. She's, uh, all right, let me see. So long as I wear this costume, we cannot lose. Let's see. We are definitely going to win. Try and get her as much as her fast for it. It really just takes forever to get that first SP. By the time it like gets her fully up and ready, it's just no time to actually do anything. Mischief maker! Let's see. 
and it's hard to like really say why it's worse now. Just know that it was faster pre-Mana Spiral. Alright, we seem to have been able to break, which is good. Okay, use this. We should be able to get the... Oh, it's gonna be under 10 seconds again. Come on. There we go. Now, we'll go here. Try and get as much damage into him as we can in three seconds. Damn, really missed again. Okay, this time I'm just gonna use, um, use him right away. You know what? I got a better idea. One moment. All right, I'm back. The only change I've made to the team is that I've made Sharina better. Uh, actually, here's another thing I'm gonna change, just in case. I am going to add the Prince as a friend. The only thing that is different is that now Sharina has full uh, Paralyzed Punisher to help out with. And when paralysis, now the user gets stronger. So let's try here. And a lot of this is based off the DPS charts with a little bit of difference just because I don't have a blade ready. So obviously if I had a blade, that would be what you want for her, but I don't really have that kind of team set up. And also I'm pretty positive the team could not survive. Um, and I'm also missing a weapon, of course. There's a lot of obvious factors. I'm like, okay, well, there's a way that it could be better. I'm not going to use the Prince friend right away, just because I want to see. I want to get here. I would say I want to see if the one change I made is enough to make it better. Second Maiden, Mischief Maker. She haws in his face. There we go. Oh yeah, this is a little bit better. She's a little bit faster now. Yeah, this is a much better setup, I think. There we go. Let's see if we can actually get it done, though. Come on. We got this. I wasn't able to get it fast enough. And then... Are you impressed? No, it looks like we're not going to make it. Why did I bother dressing up? Okay, I'm going to use the prince friend now. Again, usually when I've mana spiraled characters at this specific level, they've never had a problem dealing with low level. Like, this is not a very hard part of the Mercury Gauntlet at all. This is kind of insane, I think. Okay. So I'm gonna start immediately with the prince. I don't have the prince. Okay, one moment. Give up. I forgot, he completely kicks me out of the damn screen. Okay. Wrong one. Go back. You get to play tricks. No. And eat free candy? Shut up, Luca. There it is. Okay. Let's see if with the attack buff from Prince, if that's going to be enough to make a change. But yeah, the... It's rough. She was, it's its crazy how much slower her skill one is now. It's insanely slow. Okay, let's start with that. I forgot. This is the last one. Let's finish this. Yes, let's end this quickly. Okay. Oh, Sacred Maiden. Then go in here. Rising Circlet. Give Rising Circlet. I'm actually slower, I think. No, I did a break around the same time. I'm gonna use him now. It's like Fool's Aaron trying to get that level 3. Yeah, that was what's actually holding me back from beating it. Is trying to actually get my level. That's insane. I can't believe how much she hasn't really. This improved. costume really turned the tide. Mm, 
All right. I'm gonna find that post that broke down specifically on the Dragalia Reddit that said, what is the changes that have been made? Because it sounded like, when I read it, I was like, well, let me see. Let me quickly go here and then. The damage on her skill one went from 115% to 117. The team strength increase went from 10% to 13, not even 15%. The healing went from 90% to 108%. And against a paralyzed enemy, the third skill one only deals 900, 980%. All of this for the cost of more than double the cost of the whole rotation. So originally it cost way less. It went from about 7,500 SP to 16k SP. Uh, skill 2 now deal, deals only one hit of 850%, so 20% more compared to before, and probably much faster animation, so quicker SP gain. It now fills 700 SP instead of 500. Um, that's really the main difference. So, I don't know. She seems really underpowered, if I'm being honest here. She's not... For what is supposed to be... Like, I love Halloween Ellie. This is, like... This is borderline heartbreaking. Also, okay, so... I've done it. There's no going back. Um, she is, based on the DPSM, better. She just looks worse on paper. So it's more like... I guess they kind of attuned her specifically, so... She wouldn't be game breaking because I guess they were afraid if they made Mischief Maker too good, then you would do nothing but spam Sacred Maiden. But that doesn't matter if the unit if if the mana spirals are supposed to be making the unit better. It doesn't make sense to make a unit worse to make them only slightly better. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Everything about this mana spiral makes no sense to me. I don't know. Maybe I'm being too down on her, but I really think that this is... I thought um, the free-to-play Celiara with her um, debuff, I think that might actually be the worst mana spiral. This might be number two. I don't know. I'm not feeling it. It almost feels like they might have messed up. I really hope... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send in some feedback to Dragalia and say, please buff this, because this is unacceptable. This is seriously unacceptable. Because... If this was a 4, fine, a free-to-play 4, this is a 5 that is limited to a banner that only shows up once or twice a year. That's insane to me. And th this specific buff costs so much resources, so many resources, and only for a marginal increase, it doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense to me. I'm sorry. That's the end of today's video, otherwise I'm just going to end up ranting more and more, I think. Tell me about what you think about it. If you actually really do like this Mana Spiral for her, tell me, and I'll gladly read what you have to say. I don't I don't need to feel like I'm attacking anyone if you really do like how she plays now. I personally do wish that she was improved in some way. I don't think she's worth it at the current moment. It does not help that currently there's no real good light con- there's no real reason to use a light unit, but I don't know. Feels bad. Feels very bad. Um... That's the end of today's video, everyone. I hope you liked it. Remember to leave a like if you did. Comment again about how you're feeling about her specifically. And um, subscribe if you want more Jigalia stuff. I also do other gacha games too. But that's it. Alright. Goodbye, everyone. Have a nice day. And don't waste any material unless they buff the Mana Spiral buff rally. Bye.